Dulwich Hamlet welcome old rivals Hampton and Richmond Borough to Champion Hill this evening in their third pre-season game in four days. Last night at Hamlet 11 suffered a 3-2 loss away to Cray Valley Paper Mills to continue their winless pre-season and have made 11 changes with five players involved last night on the bench. The Beavers beat Aldershot in their last outing by two goals to one. Max Kretschmar and Brendan Kiernan grabbing the goals. Amongst their starting lineup are ex-Hamlet players Emiliano Heisey, Michael Kamara and Ryan Moss. So can the Hamlet get their first victory of the new campaign or will it be a Hampton win ahead of their delayed Middlesex Senior Cup final next week? I've said it a few times over the last week or so, it's not really about the results, it's about getting the players fit and ready for the 12th of August when the season begins. But I know they'll be wanting to get a couple of wins under their belt if possible, just to uh, go in with a bit of confidence. Winning mentality. Weatherstone, captain again tonight. Sloppy from him though, waited too long for the ball to come to him. It's Chinua Cole, beats Weatherstone and Ming, draws Edwards, who uh, stuck out a leg. In Bentley referee again tonight. He was here on Tuesday night, as were his officials. Agreed to do another game. That's a heavy challenge by Action Pong, went over the ball. Gallagher will send this in. Kamara and Wasma forward from centre back. Crawford and Marriott in the penalty area and Moss. And it comes. Crew didn't get a touch. Weatherstone did. And there's a goal in there. Dulwich didn't clear their lines effectively. And it's the away side who take the lead. Both Carew and Weatherstone not getting the uh, touches they needed. It's Harry Crawford who's gone the score sheet. It was in by Sam Gallagher. Missed Carew. Weatherstone got half a touch. Fell kindly for Crawford. And he finishes high beyond Preston Edwards. Carew floats that one in towards Weatherstone. Timed his run well enough and his jump, but couldn't keep the header down and he's disappointed with himself. Half an opportunity for the Dulwich skipper. Well, the three centre-backs Dulwich had last year, well, the, sorry, the five centre-backs Dulwich had last year. He was the leading scorer of all of them. There's another chance here for two. Marriott puts it wide. Dulwich defence like a ghost there. Marriott got his way through. Trying to put it into the bottom corner. Dragged it wide of the post. Chambers. Well time run by Carew. Plucked it out the sky, Ashley Carew. Excellent control from him. Taking on Michael Kamara. Feints across, now does, pulls back. Rolf, Rolf Kotoy. Oh, Kotoy was in on the act there, but couldn't keep his shot down. Crawford's been busy so far in this game. Out to Jelly it goes. He can bring it forward if he chooses. Williams. High seat. Cole. Williams back to Chinua Cole into the area. He goes away from Chambers. Saved by the boot of Edwards. Fine Hampton move. And a fine save as well by the Dulwich custodian. Moss. Crawford bursting from deep. All the way through he goes. And Edwards again smothers the shot. He's having a good game. Preston Edwards denies Crawford a second. And Dulwich ripped open again there. Carew. Scored two goals when the sides met here in September 2014 on non-league day. Here goes Green. Can he beat Wasper? Yes, he can. And Green is the area. Off the post. And it's behind for a corner. Green bursting through there, signs of life in the Dulwich attack. Oh, Cotoy's gone short if he wants to use him. He's going to ignore him though. See here it comes, easily cleared. Out as far as Cargbo. Don't want to give him room for a shot. We've seen a few times last season what he can uh, do from that sort of range. All the way back with Edwards it is now. Williams trying to close him down. Not a great clearance though, and it's come from Marriott. Only Ming in to uh, help out. Here is Williams. Another fine save by Edwards. What a first half Preston Edwards is having. It was his poor clearance, but he redeems himself with the save. Crawford trying to get between two men. Aching Pong. New Ming was on the outside. There was a foul in there on Aching Pong. Ming, Clunis. Ming's on the overlap still. 
Taking too long, like Lunis. Couldn't use him. Uses Kotoy instead. And he's gone for goal again. Like his first shot. Not testing Sam House. Kondalic finding a uh, little deserved equaliser. Achim Pong. Ming. It was a foul by Crawford. Uses Clunis though, Ming. And it comes towards Goulding, nodded away. Picked up by Green. First touch is in front of him. Shrug off the challenge. Green, 1-1. One, one. Came close earlier, hit the post. That time, Nathan Green finds the back of the net. And just as he did in last season's fixture between the two sides, finds himself on the score sheet. It was good work from Ming. He was fouled, but uh, played a pass down the line for Clunis. Sent in the cross. Green arrived, first touch, took it in front of him, shrugged off a challenge and his shot did take a deflection on its way in. Dulles draw level. It's poor from Kargbo, really sloppy play. Unchallenged, couldn't return the ball to Achim Pong and gifts Hampton and Richmond a throw. Marriott, he was denied at least once in that first half by Edwards. And put another one wide as well when he should have scored. Gallagher. Cole went down. It's wide with Gallagher. Players queued up in the box. One's Moss. Another good save by Edwards. Still alive with uh, Marriott. Pure instinct save by Preston Edwards. And crew find a Dulwich head. Floated in. Yes, he can. Weatherstone was there. It's deflected wide for another corner. Chambers. One in the air. Clunis again was uh, lurking. Kretschmar, Brendan Kiernan, top scorer last season after Lowe and Kabamba departed. All three of those players reached 20 or more goals during the season. But uh, the first two, Lowe and Kabamba, got there before um, they left in January. Here he is again, Brendan Kiernan. He's gone for a speculative effort. Not troubling Preston Edwards this time. Uh, Hampton Richmond man. Nods it down to Clunis. Chipped up towards the marker. Tracking back though was Jolly. Hampton trying to ramp up through the gears again, perhaps. Roberts away from Weatherstone. Still Terry and Roberts. Fains across. Now does send it in. Pretty deep ball in. Free header at the far post for Max Kretschmar. And he should really have tested Edwards there, but only glances wide. Kosoi, Tomlin, on for Clunis it goes. Well played, DeMarca. Can he find room for a shot? Yes, he can. Deflects into the arms of Billy Bishop. Stand up nicely for the goalkeeper. Good intent shown by Clunis and DeMarca there, though. And ball surely by Cully. Not spotted by the referee. Almost caught the ball there. On for Roberts. Taken on Weatherstone. On the outside he goes. And there is a goal in there. And uh, the away side take the lead is Brendan Kiernan. Well, it's a bit controversial because there was a handball in the build up to that goal. But uh, Brendan Kiernan won't mind. Kiernan. The ball was played wide by Cully to Roberts. Did well to beat uh, Mark Weatherstone. I put it into the middle. Kiernan's there to poke home. Gavin Rose said on interview last night that they've had good pre-seasons and not a good season. And bad pre-seasons and uh, had a good season. So they won't be minding the results. But they might be in again here, Hampton. Kretschmar from distance. Wide of Edwards' far post. Sent long by Bishop. Cully again handled the ball, as he did for the goal. Kiernan. Cully, there's four up in this attack. Cully takes aim. Doesn't test Edwards, though. Watch all the way the goalkeeper. Kiernan. Taylor sees it clear. Michael Kamara, though, coming out of defence down this right wing. Unfamiliar territory for him tonight. Ambitious from Kiernan. High and wide from him. Dulles struck late in the first half. Can they do so again in the second? Referee's ready. 
That's a long way over from Gavin Tomlin. Up over the wall, but not down again. And that's the full-time whistle. And Hampton Richmond Borough have won this evening here at Champion Hill. Probably uh, deserved on the run of play this evening. They had the majority of the chances. and But for Preston Edwards in the Dulwich goal, it could have been a bigger score than uh, just the two goals. They went ahead in the first half. A free kick came in. Wasn't dealt with by Crew nor Weatherstone. And uh, Harry Crawford finished high past the goalkeeper. After that, Edwards made several great stops in that first half to keep uh, Hampton at bay. And Dulwich drew level five minutes before the break. Nathan Green coming forward from left back and uh, finishing via a deflection. In the second half, fewer chances for both sides. Edwards again keeping out uh, Hampton man in Ryan Moss for a late goal from Brendan Kiernan. A bit of controversy in the build-up. There may have been a handball from Duncan Cully, but uh, Kiernan was in the right place in the right time in the penalty area to uh, hit home. Dulles still without a win this pre-season, but uh, they got some valuable minutes in their belt this evening. The players only disappointing for them was the uh, removal of Ricky Hales in the first half to injury. But final score at Champion Hill in this pre-season friendly is Dulles Hamlet 1, Hampton Richmond Borough 2.